Hello, my name is Emily, as you may or may not know, and today I want to talk about periods! That's right, semicolons, commas, parentheses, you may now all exit the building, because the star of today's show is the period. Now, maybe not all of you can relate to the things that I'm going to talk about, but even if you don't experience periods, I advise you to continue watching my video for educational purposes. This is essentially the Discovery Channel. Now, having your period can really put a dent in your plans or at the very least make your plans a little less enjoyable. Especially for things like the beach. I mean, you can wear a tampon, but there's always a chance that your string is gonna hang out of your swimsuit and you're just gonna look like a light bulb in one of those old moldy basements with the pull string. Or if you're on your period, you can't wear certain outfits. You know, for me, I have quite a heavy flow. There, I said it. We're close enough now that I, I feel comfortable enough to be talking about my flow. Which is heavy. So oftentimes I have to wear a pad and a tampon and pads can very easily show through certain pants. And you know, the outline of a menstrual diaper doesn't really complete my outfit and make me look like I'm ready for fashion week. So depending on what your plans are, your period can ruin them. No, yeah, it is gonna be so fun. We're gonna go to the beach and I can wear my new bikini that's as white as a PTA meeting in a small conservative town in the South. And then, you know, I have this mini dress that I'm gonna wear when we go clubbing. And of course it's also white. And then I'm gonna see my girlfriend who I haven't seen in weeks so we can finally Hey girl. No, not today. I'm wearing nice underwear. It's already been a month. Isn't that crazy? Why don't you bother someone else, you Oh, No, I am so sorry. Not you. So, we're going to the beach, huh? No. No, 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 no. No. I am going to the beach. You are not invited. Well, as long as you have your uterus inside you, we're kind of a package deal. God, this is so annoying. Do you want me to schedule you a hysterectomy? No, I don't want a hysterectomy. Just... Ugh, you know, like, why did you have to come the week when I have all these fun plans and I finally get to see my girlfriend? Look, if I could just go away, I would, all right? Because you're kind of a bitch and I don't like spending time with you, but your uterine lining is not going to shed itself. So here I am. Mm, well, thank you for your service. You're welcome. God, I shouldn't have bought that white mini dress. God, I should have known this was going to happen. Yeah, you should have. I mean, I've been coming to you every month ever since that summer in 2011 when you bled through your plaid Bermuda shorts. Yes, thank you. I remember. And honestly, I did you a favor that day because those shorts were ugly. My mom bought me those shorts. Oh. They were still ugly. I know. Okay, you don't have to keep... Oh god, my girlfriend's calling. Oh, let me talk to her. Well, she's never happy to see you, so maybe you should just stay quiet. Well, if I wasn't around, that would mean that you got pregnant by a man. So I think she should be quite happy to see me, actually. Shh. Hey, babe. Hey, are you excited for the trip? I literally can't wait. I'm like counting down the Hey, day. girl. Who is that? It's- Promise you won't be mad at me, okay? Just act like I'm not even there. You can put down a towel. Ew, chill out. And you guys can still spend quality time together even though I'm there. Okay, is this who I think it is? Please tell me I'm wrong. It's already been a month. Can you believe it? Oh my god, no! No, 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 no. Now periods are really just, they can be the worst, you know? It just makes you feel gross, you know? I mean, you're bloated and you're having cramps and you're in pain. I mean, honestly, your uterus just feels like a punching bag for a teenager with anger issues. You know, my cramps used to not be that bad, but as of recently, um, they've really started to take a number on me. Take several numbers on me, actually. I've had to walk around work like hunched over. Like I've almost had to start kneeling down because I am in such pain. I'm literally walking around work like this, exactly like this. Just through the halls of the hospital, just like this. If any of my coworkers are watching this, I'm sure at least one of them would be able to uh, maybe confirm. Actually, they probably aren't paying attention to me. They're probably paying attention to their patients, which is uh, good. Also, if you're watching this, maybe don't. <laughs> and sometimes it just comes out of nowhere. Like, I'll be walking around generally fine, and then all of a sudden I'm in pain. Like, for people who don't have periods, imagine this. Oh my god! 
Also, although this narrative is outdated, there are still some people who believe that a period can cause someone to become very irrational or, you know, make someone crazy. Can you even see? Crazy. Many people think that the hormonal changes that go on during someone's menstrual cycle makes that person, you know, incapable of making reasonable decisions which is just untrue. Having your period doesn't turn you into a different person. Like, yeah, you can get a little more irritable and sometimes you can cry for no reason, but that doesn't mean that I've lost brain cells. Some people act like being on your period takes away your ability to make rational choices. The company is beginning to tank. These next few weeks are crucial. If we slip up even once, we could risk everything. Now, what ideas do we have for the social media campaign? Well, it seems like many apps these days are utilizing stories, so I was thinking that we could... Are, are you all right? I'm, I'm fine. It's just my period. Do you need to go to the bathroom? No, no. What I need to do is tweet racial slurs from the company Twitter. What? My period. It's giving me ideas, you know. I think, I think I should have a press conference and tell everyone that we are converting the company to a douching company and we will be making douches out of mayonnaise and hot sauce. What are you talking about? Okay, douching is bad for vaginal health in general, especially if it's made out of hot sauce and mayonnaise. But it's what's best for the company. No, it's, it's really not, okay? You're, you're just on your period, okay? You're not thinking straight. No, no, I'm not thinking straight. I'm thinking gay. What? I think I should leave my husband. I mean, we've been married for 14 perfect years and we have three children, but what does that matter? You know? Women are cooler, anyways. No! Well, yes, they are very cool, but you love your husband. He is a good man. No, 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 no. My menstrual cycle is making me think crystal clear. All right? I want to ruin my perfect marriage! What are you doing after this? Okay, I'm not gonna call HR because your menses is clearly clouding your mind, but you know what? Just take the rest of the week off, all right? You're clearly on your period, just take Let's it set easy. the building on fire. No! I just deleted all the company files off of my hard drive. You what? We should move the company to Atlanta. What? We can't just move the company to Atlanta. Sorry, that's my mistake. I meant Atlantis. You want to move the company to the fictional city of Atlantis. Yes. yes, we can just grow gills. It's not that hard. And if we can't do it, then we can just hold our breath. Look, I'll do it right now. Okay, seriously, stop. You are risking the entire company because you are on your period. Now I, stop holding your breath. Well, did you faint? That was only like 10 seconds. And I understand, periods are our uterus's way of telling us that we're not pregnant. And that's great and all, but like... Okay... Like, I could have told you that. Like, shouldn't we be rewarded or something instead? You know, like, bring me a cake every month. Like, yay, you're not pregnant! Well, it looks like it's that time of month again. Hey, girl. Yeah, I'm just on time. So, what's the verdict? So, drumroll please. You're not pregnant! Here's a cookie! Oh my god, thank you! Of course, have a great day! Also, you're like, really pretty. Your bone structure is amazing. Thank you, you too! I love this time of the month. So I hope you enjoyed today's video, and for those of you watching who do have periods, I hope they don't give you that much trouble, because trust me, I know your pain. But uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching, and until next time. Wear my bikini that's as white as a... <sighs> my new bikini that's as white as a PTA meeting in a small conservative... Okay, so I'm just gonna pretend like I'm doing something and then just like slap me. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. That was my fault. That was my fault. I laughed. Okay, serious, serious time. What the hell? Why do we have to do it again? I'm so sorry. I'm trying to think of what my reaction should be. Yeah, you should think of that ahead of time. Oh my god! Thank you. <laughs> oh, ouch! Ow! Oh. oh my god. Ouch! Ow!